what is going on everyone I am back here with another video for you guys today and today I'm gonna to be showing you guys how to add cards slash passes to passbook in iOS 7 now keep in mind that these passes are not uh, legitimate passes or cards uh, they are for demonstrational purposes only, and they do not work in a store. So please, please do not try to use these in a store to purchase something, because it will not work. So, please just keep that in mind. But, anyway, uh, with that being said, let's go ahead uh, and get started. <clears throat> so what you're going to need to do is, uh, on your phone, head over to Safari. And in the address field, you want to type in PassSource.com. Uh, I'll provide a link in the description for you guys. Uh, but anyway, yeah, go to PassSource.com right here. Uh, then you'll be brought to this page here where it says Let's Get Started. So you can either hit Create and jump straight into um, a creation page to start creating a card or pass. Uh, really quick, or you can join or log into their website. Uh, but I don't particularly see the need to join their website with an account because all you're going to be doing is creating a, a pass inside here, so you don't really need an account. So, what we're going to do is hit create. <clears throat> okay, and then it'll be brought here where you can select from a wide variety of different uh, cards. So, I'm not going to name all of them, but I'll just scroll through the uh, page here so you can get an idea of all the different cards uh, that you have available to add to passbook so that, but yeah as you can see there is quite a lot of different cards and different stores and coupons and stuff that you can add to the passbook app here so I'm going to scroll all the way to the bottom and there you go that's all the cards and passes that you can add. <clears throat> so, let's see. Which one do I want to choose? Uh, let's do this one here. GameStop Power Up Rewards Card. So, let's go ahead and click that. Okay, now it'll bring you to this page where you can actually adjust some of the settings for the actual card. So, you can choose the name of the card, uh, the uh, store ID, which it's, of course, a fake ID because... Like I said, this is for demonstrational purposes only, and is not actually usable. Uh, but you can put a fake barcode number, a uh, rewards card number, and then you can put a fake name to be displayed on the card. So, currently it says Johnny Appleseed, but I'm going to change that to something else. Let's say, uh, Bob, uh, let's say, just say Bob Hope, just for the heck of it just to make it fun uh so there you go you could change the details like that uh and then when you're done you hit create <clears throat> and you'll see this it'll jump up here at uh asking you if you'd like to add this pass to passbook as you can see bob hope is on the name uh then we have the barcode number and everything like that so if you want to add the pass to passbook go ahead up here hit add and it'll jump it right down into your passbook section. And then that's basically it. You've basically added a fake pass or card to your passbook app. So now let's go ahead and jump out to the application. So let's go into passbook. As you can see there, uh, you got your pass that you just added. Uh, so then you can just adjust it and do some fun stuff with it. You could send it via message or mail or airdrop if you have that activated and uh, then you can hit the little eye over here and get some more information on that particular card so you can say update this pass uh, by going to this link so if the pass needs updated or if you want to add additional information change the name or anything like that uh, you just need to hit the link right here and you can quickly do that if you would like to uh, if you'd like to create uh, a similar pass as it says here you can hit this link and create another pass somewhat identical to the one that you cre just created uh, it says created by pass source and whatever whatever all that information there then you have the standard little options here that you can choose if you have a pass like if it was legitimate you can do automatic updates or show on the lock screen but 
Uh, both of these will not work, like I said, because it is demonstration only. Uh, so, now if you want to delete the pass uh, that you just added using this little method here, just go ahead and hit the usual delete button, hit delete, and there you go, the pass is now deleted. So, it's pretty cool. Uh, let's it, You can show it off to your friends saying that you have a ton of pass or cars in passbook and say that you have money and whatnot. But yeah, it's for it's fun, fun little thing to do. Uh, but anyway, yeah, that's basically how you add fake demonstrational cards to Passbook uh, using pass, uh, PassSource.com. So, yeah, hope this you guys have enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button right down there. Uh, also, thumbs up the video that is always appreciated and helps out my channel. Let me know that you guys are liking my uh, videos. Um, also, if you guys have any questions or comments, uh, leave those in the comment section below, and I will get back to your guys' uh, comments as soon as I can. Uh, so, with that being said, once again, hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.